Hello pups and welcome back to another episode of the Elder Scrolls Skyrim with your boy Shoji Shuma. Uh, I know it's been a while. Uh, you guys were telling me on my last recording the voice was a little low. Sorry about that. Uh, I thought I tested it and checked it but it seems like it didn't uh, record loudly my voice. I'm not sure as to why but you know gonna do a little bit of adjustments and hopefully this time the voice is not as low so last time we left off I got done searching for that uh shush you I got done searching for the uh the horn which wasn't in there and I had to go watch the skies traveler back to one of the starter villages now I know it's a bit of a damn travel I don't know if you guys want me to do fast traveling or just walking no one's really uh, commenting on that part yet or anything you know um, you can't wait there's enemies nearby what the hell Oh, it's a spider. Uh, yeah, no one's really commented on it on whether they want me to do the fast traveling or not. <coughs> I mean, as I said before, I feel that half of the fun of these games like this is the traveling between location to location because of the random things that can happen. But I also feel on games like this, that also takes a lot of time from the recording um, you know because of you know, all the time it takes to travel from location to location so I'm sorry I just forgot to set up my timer so I'm doing that right now mm, there we go <coughs> so oh, sorry about that Still got a little bit of a cough, but I am doing a whole lot more better than what I was the last two weeks. Um, let me know what you guys would rather. Would you rather have me footing it from location to location? Or would you rather have me, you know, using that fast travel? Uh, so how you pups have been, you know. I've been okay, you know, getting over this cold, so, you know, feeling a lot better, like I said. i um, actually kind of excited because me and my wife are trying to get a second PlayStation for us. So that way I have my own PlayStation and she has hers, and uh, we can play um, some games together, online games and stuff like that. And hopefully, you know, maybe do it that way of making a party and me and her playing games together and recording it from my end. And uh, me posting that on uh, YouTube. Uh, one of the main problems we're going to run into, though, is the lack of memory. I mean, um, I'm getting a PlayStation Pro with one terabyte in it. Her PlayStation, the one I'm currently playing on, has two terabytes on it. Uh, I bought an external dr up the drive and put it in there, swapped it out. <coughs> the issue with that, we've been having a lot of problems with games crashing and stuff. And uh, it's getting a bit annoying. It's getting a bit annoying. And... Uh, what I wanted to do was buy a like four terabyte external drive and do that for my system and then get her another four terabytes on her system as well. Again, you know, the memory is a big problem because, you know, games take up shit to the memory. I mean, I'm looking at 109 gigabytes for our Call of Duty Black Ops with all the DLC. And it's, it's like a ridiculous amount of memory <coughs> being used up right there. Oh, where am I going? You know what? I think I might just fast travel for now. Let's just fast travel today. Let's just fast travel. I don't want to expose. You know, that's a long way away. Let's just fast travel. That elf, though, I mean, look at that. Look at that armor. Spiffy. in here river wood oh you got a lovely bunch of cabbages but you seem all right 
Thank you. I'm glad that you might think so. Can woo Camilla Valerius away from me. She's already mine, I keep telling you. <coughs> yep. But, uh, you know, we got a few plans going in. We're trying to do things. I'm trying to actually mess around with that editing thing. And, uh, edit up like a cover video. You know how you got the video that tells you what the game's about. And, like, You're you know, that visitor been poking around. I'm the innkeeper. It's my bi attic room, eh? Well, we don't have an attic room. But you can have the one on the left. Make yourself at home. Oh, the one on the left. The left. Okay, okay. There's no attic room. I'll take the one on the left then. We'll sleep in the bed like eight hours like a normal person, right? So you're the dragonborn I've been hearing so much about. I think you're looking for this. We need to talk. Do we? Follow me. Okay. Can you can you walk? We got rooms and food. Drink too. I cook. Ain't much else to tell. You cook? Awesome. You look like you'd be a great cook. Need a room? Talk to Delphine. If Delphine would get her ass out here. I'm just a cook, lad. Okay. Chill out, dude. Seriously. <coughs> Oof. Close the door. Uh oh, I'm sorry. Sorry, Lydia, you can't be part of this. Now we can talk. Lydia, close the door. Ew, what's this? The Greybeards seem to think you're the Dragonborn. I hope they're right. Surprised? I guess I'm getting pretty good at my harmless innkeeper act. Mm -hmm. You can't be too careful. Thalmor spies are everywhere. I didn't go to all this trouble on a whim. I needed to make sure it wasn't a Thalmor trap. Oh, yeah, you know. I am not your enemy. I already gave you the horn. I'm actually trying to help you. I just need you to hear me out. Okay. Like I said in my note, I've heard that you might be Dragonborn. I'm part of a group that's been looking for you. Well, someone like you, for a very long time. Mm -hmm. If you really are Dragonborn, that is. Before I tell you any more, I need to make sure I can trust you. Oh. Well. If you don't trust me, you were a fool to walk in here in the first place. Oh no, I'm a fool, I guess. We remember what most don't, that the Dragonborn is the ultimate dragon slayer. <laughs> You're the only one that can kill a dragon permanently by devouring its soul. Can Ooh. you do it? Can you devour a dragon's soul? Good. And you'll have a chance to prove it to me soon enough. Awesome. I knew the Greybeards would send you there if they thought you were dragonborn. They're nothing if not predictable. When you showed up here, I knew you were the one the Greybeard sent, and not some Thalmor plant. Yes, we're very old enemies. And if my suspicions are correct, they might have something to do with the dragons returning. But that isn't important right now. What is important is that you might be dragonborn. Dragons aren't just coming back. They're coming back to life. They weren't gone somewhere for all these years. They were dead, killed off centuries ago by my predecessors. Now something's happening to bring them back to life, and I need you to help me stop Jesus, it. Jesus, Miko, can you shut up? I know they are. I visited their ancient burial mounds and found them empty, and I figured out where the next one will come back to life. 
We're going to go there, and you're going to kill that dragon. If we succeed, I'll tell you anything you want to know. Awesome. <coughs> Kynes Grove. There's an ancient dragon burial near there. If we can get there before it happens, maybe we'll learn how to stop it. I need to get into my traveling gear. Give me a minute and I'll be ready. Okay. You got any nifty, uh... That's better. Let's get on the road to Kynes Grove. Arrows. Oh no, I'm over encumbered again. What? All my books in here, <laughs> at least for now. Why do I got a pot? Oh, it's a quest item. I can't get rid of it. What the hell? I gotta learn those spells. That, that 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 would probably help out, huh? I'm traveling. You've got the <coughs> Let's read these books here. Until I get back. Right. The, 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 stupid dog. adventure time. Kynes Grove is this way. We can travel together or split up and meet there. Your choice. What is it? Come on, we've got to get to Kynes Grove. You're the one standing there, lady. Yeah. Look at the fast travel delivery for that one. Let's get right into this dragon slaying stuff, man. Let's do this. Let's do it to it. So, I mean, do you guys are, are liking me doing the Skyrim? Uh, do you guys like me doing uh This is Kynes Grove. Dying Light? Not much to look at. The innkeeper ought to be able to tell us if there's any dragon mouth nearby. Uh oh. Wait, something's wrong. No! You don't want to go up there! A dragon! It's attacking! It's attacking! It flew over the town and landed on the old dragon <laughs> burial mound. I don't know what it's doing up there, but I'm not waiting around to find out. Sweet.
We gotta find some place to hide. Come on, hurry. We might be too late. Oh, look at that. Look at that lag. Come on. We need to find out what's happening up there. Lorcan's eyes. Look at that big bastard. Right. Come on, man, what are you doing? I didn't equip my fucking... <laughs> This one, dirty damage. Oh, <laughs> 
So you really are... Get them bones, man. Uh, it's true, isn't it? You really are Dragonborn. Nah, I'm just some guy with yelling abilities. I owe you some answers, don't I? Nope. Go ahead. Whatever you want to know. <coughs> Nothing held back. Thank you. I'm one of the last members of the Blades. A very long time ago, the Blades were Dragon Slayers, and we served the Dragonborn, the greatest Dragon Slayer. For the last 200 years since the last Dragonborn Emperor, the Blades have been searching for a purpose. Now that dragons are coming back, our purpose is clear again. Oh, yeah. We need to stop them. Not a damn thing. I was just as surprised as you to find that big black dragon here. Big black dragon. Really? Where? Interesting. Same dragon. Damn it. We're blundering around in the dark here. We need to figure out who's behind it all. Exactly. Nobody even remembers our name these days. We used to be known across Tamriel as the protectors of the Septim Emperors. Those days are long gone. For the last 200 years, we've been searching for the next Dragonborn to guide and guard, as we are sworn to do. But we never found one, until now. The first thing we need to do is figure out who's behind the dragons. The Thalmor are our best lead. If they aren't involved, they'll know who is. Mm. Nothing solid, yet. But my gut tells me it can't be anybody else. Mm. The Empire had captured Ulfric. The war was basically over. Then a dragon attacks, Ulfric escapes, and the war is back on. And now the dragons are attacking everywhere, indiscriminately. Skyrim is weakened. The Empire is weakened. Who else gains from that but the Thalmor? If we could get into the Thalmor Embassy, it's the center of their operations in Skyrim. Problem is, that place is locked up tighter than a miser's purse. They could teach me a few things about paranoia. Hmm, I'm not sure yet. I have a few ideas, but I'll need some time to pull things together. Meet me back in Riverwood. If I'm not back when you get there, wait for me. I shouldn't be long. Okay. Keep an eye on the sky. This is only going to get worse. Yes, ma'am. All right, Lydia. I'm right behind you. I am sworn to carry your burdens. Damn right you are. You're gonna carry my burdens, all right. Dragon burdens. Lead on. All right, so <clears throat> what the hell? I think it's safe to say right now that we need to uh, return that horn. So let's do that real quick. Time flies. Time flies. I'm only level seven. Ah, you've retrieved the horn of Jorgen Wincom. Yes. Well done. You have now passed all the trials. Thank you. 
Come with me. It is time for us to recognize you formally as Dragonborn. Awesome. The final word of unrelenting force. Da. Da. Push. Da. With all three words together, this shout is much more powerful. Use it wisely. Master Wolf Tower will now give you his knowledge of Da. Like you would speak to chill in there. Stand between us and prepare yourself. Few can withstand the unbridled voice of the Greybeards. Oh, bye. But you are ready. Vindra, the voice of the Greybeards and pass through unscathed. High Hrothgar is open to you. traditional words of greeting to a dragonborn who has accepted our guidance. Oh. The same words were used to greet the young Kalos <coughs> when he came to High Hrothgar before he became the Emperor Tiber Septim. Ah, I sometimes forget you are not versed in the dragon tongue as we are. This is a rough translation. Yes, please. Long has the storm crown languished with no worthy brow to sit upon. By our breath, we bestow it now to you in the name of Kine, in the name of Shore, and in the name of Atmora of old. You are Ismir now, the dragon of the north. Hearken to it. You have learned so much already, Dragonborn. Growing your gift too quickly would be dangerous. Mm. But there are many words of power in Skyrim carved in the dragon tongue. Even from here, we can feel the thune resonate from them. Finding these lost words would be a sufficient test to temper your abilities with experience. Ask when you are ready to search. Okay, awesome. Dragons have always been able to shout. Language is intrinsic to their very being. There is no difference in the dragon tongue between debating and fighting. Shouting comes as naturally to a dragon as breathing or speaking. In mythic times, when mortal kind was in great need, the goddess Kinnereth granted us the ability to speak as dragons do. Oh. For most people, long years of training are required to learn even the simplest shout. But for you, the dragon speech is in your blood, and you learn it almost without effort. Five, our leader, Parthenax, 
lives alone on the peak of the throat of the world. When your voice can open the path, you will know you are ready to speak to him. Sky oh, right. voice within. Yeah, thank you. Alrighty. Well, that will conclude this episode. Thanks for watching. Leave that like, share, subscribe, slap the notification pups. I mean, you know, so that way you know whenever I'm posting the newest videos. Uh, definitely share with your friends. Please do. I mean, you know, let your friends know. If you think if you think these videos are great and you want more people to watch it, I mean, I definitely want more people to watch. I would love to have more subscribers and stuff. You know, but share it. You know, share the hell out of it. Why don't you? And uh, definitely leave that like. Please leave them likes. Let's see if we can get over 10 likes on a video I mean I've been getting like maybe five likes so let's see if we can get more than that let's just try to boost up these likes and uh, we've been staying at 39 subscribers so you know that's not a bad number and I'm, I'm, I'm glad to have actually 39 subscribers now but you know let's just try to get these numbers up a little bit every little bit helps in uh, exposure for this channel <coughs> this dog is not my nerves hold on Anyways, every little bit helps for exposure for this channel, and um, I would love to keep doing this. As I said, this is something that I'm very passionate about. I love doing it. I love playing games and recording them for you guys and, you know, communicating with you guys. And your comments always uh, brighten my day a bit. <coughs> and uh, I really want to keep doing this. I would love to be able to do it more full time. But at the moment, like I said before, as it is, it's not possible because of work and stuff. But, you know, um, right now we got a lot of holidays coming up. So I will be having days where I won't be recording. You know, we got Thanksgiving. We got um, Christmas coming up. I got a few birthdays and stuff coming up. So there will be days where I might not be able to record. And I will try to let you guys know ahead of time on my, on my um, Twitter account. So go ahead and, and, and look me up on Twitter. Um, this should be at Shoji Shuma uh, and uh, you know definitely keep an eye there I will be uh, letting people know when I can't record on there most of the time I will try to post up a somewhat of a schedule on here and uh, as I said before I might be doing some online games and if you guys got PS4s and play these games I would be more than happy to play with you guys on one of my recordings um, I know most of you don't get on till around like after the afternoon time. Um, I'm on Eastern time, so I'm usually done before two in the afternoon. So, uh, but in any other case, I would like to try to do some gaming with you guys if if I play any online games or do any online games online with with this. <coughs> uh, but you know. Again, you know, this is just all trial right now. I want to see what works for this channel, what you guys like. Obviously, I'm going to keep trying to do that. And uh, hopefully we can make this channel grow and become great. Thanks for watching, pups. Peace to the next video.